Sorry I'm late. Did you forget to set your alarm clock? Hello everyone and welcome back to My Nerdy Home. My name is Stephanie. Thank you so much for watching this video. We have a brand new The Batman trailer and I am so stoked for this movie. I have been stoked for this movie. I have been looking at leaks, filming of this movie. Um, this is one of my most anticipated movies of 2022. I'm really, really, really hoping that it's good. I am a DC fan as well as a Batman fan and a Riddler fan. He is my number two favorite character in the Batman rogues gallery. So I'm really looking forward to this movie and we have a brand new trailer to react to so let's go ahead and get into it all right are you ready cuz I'm ready here we go let's go Bruce Wayne sorry I wouldn't be bothering you here but your people keep telling me Ooh, you're unavailable. the bad signal you know you really could be doing more for this city a history of philanthropy but as far as i can tell you're not doing anything <laughs> oh he is <laughs> oh my gosh i'm so stoked they're already calling him the riddler the killer left this for the real change why is he writing to you <gasps> alfred we're finally seeing alfred you okay I've been trying to reach you. Oh shit! Yeah, there's latest. It's all about the Waynes. If we Ooh. don't stand up, no one will. You got a lot of cats. Everything about strays. <laughs> the bat and the cat. The bat and the cat. Oh my god. You a new friend of yours? I'm not so sure. The bat and the cat. Bad cat! <laughs> oh my god, I'm so stoked right now. You're part of this too. Oof, that's a good shot. How am I part of this? Oh shit, he's there. Oh, you're really not as smart as I thought you were. I love his voice. Poor Dude. Way. Oh my god, I can't wait for this Riddler. Oof. All these years, you lied to me, Alfred. Oh man. We all have our scars, Bruce. You're still a Wayne. He's involved in this. Oh, he's not involved. How do you know? He's a vigilante. Why are you under there? What are you hiding? Selena, don't throw your life away. Ah! Honey, I got nine of them. Ooh! Hell yeah! It can be cruel, poetic, or blind. But when it's Ooh, that looks so cool. It's your violence. Dope! Holy shit! Justice. The answer is justice. Justice, the Oh, it must be an answer to one of his riddles! Vengeance. Vengeance. Oh. Get in some trouble. Ooh. Damn, that was a good shot. Holy shit. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> this shot right here. This shot is freaking amazing. I'm so stoked for this movie. I absolutely love Paul Dano's voice as the Riddler. It sounds so creepy, so eerie, and I'm absolutely loving that. We're getting like the serial killer Riddler. He does have like minions who do his bidding for him in this movie. I'm so stoked. Those are the people that we see, Selena and Bruce, because they have teamed up, but he's not so sure if she's an ally yet, because they've teamed up, it looks like, in this trailer. They're fighting towards a common goal. Who knows what that is, because in previews, we have seen that Selena is also working with Falcone, possibly. Uh, we are getting Colin Farrell as the penguin, as Oswald Cobblepot. I don't believe he is the penguin just yet because he is working with Falcone in this movie. We got to see a little bit more of Andy Serkis' Alfred in this trailer. I'm really looking forward to that relationship. We haven't yet seen them together, really. We've seen, like, shots of them together, but nothing really, like, they're not communicating in previous trailers. I really want to see that relationship. That relationship, to me, is just as important as any relationship that Batman has in this movie. In fact, probably more so. That relationship, if you can't get Alfred and Bruce right, then it's just not going to work. Alfred is an incredibly important piece of Bruce Wayne's life, along with him, you know, being Batman. So I feel like if they don't have that chemistry, then the movie might not work. So I'm really looking forward to that relationship. We haven't yet seen it. And we finally saw Andy Serkis here playing Alfred. They're talking in the beginning about the philanthropy with his parents, and uh, he hasn't really been doing much because he's just been seeking out vengeance at night as Batman. It 
looks like there isn't a lot of trust in him with the commissioner. We saw him yelling at Gordon, saying that he's a vigilante. There's not that trust there, but it looks like him and Gordon possibly already have a relationship. Now, I believe this movie is year two of Batman's being a vigilante in Gotham. So he's in his second year as being Batman, and it looks like he already has this relationship with Gordon. I don't know if we're going to see the beginning of that relationship, or if this movie is going to start off with that relationship having already been formed. That's what it seems like in this trailer, but we will see. It doesn't look like he has any real trust built with the commissioner, the police commissioner Savage, I believe that's his name in this movie. A lot more Riddler in this trailer, and I'm really looking forward to Paul Dano. The last trailer we got, we saw the police already arresting him at that coffee shop. We didn't know that Batman himself was there for the arrest. We didn't know that. We do see him like in the interrogation. So he is working with the police to some extent. And I think that that's interesting. I'm looking forward to seeing his relationship with Gordon as well as the Gotham PD. A lot more in this trailer between Selena and Bruce. It looks like they're teaming up. And that was in the leaks. Like they would be teaming up in this movie. But they don't really trust each other just yet. I already can see their chemistry just from this trailer. So I'm looking forward to even more in this movie with Selena and Batman. I love that they put that line in there. The bat and the cat where Working together. I love that. That is so freaking awesome. He's in her place and she's got these cats and she's just like, I have a thing for strays. Selena herself in this film is in her early stages of being Catwoman because she is just mainly kind of like the comics looking out for her neighborhood first before anything else. And so whatever she's doing with Batman in this film, it's going to be for some benefit for her as well. So I am extremely interested in this movie. I'm looking forward to it so much. This trailer, this shot right here, it gets me even more excited. Are you guys excited about this movie? Um, what do you guys think about the Batman? I know a lot of people have hesitations of Robert Pattinson playing Batman. I really don't. Um, I think that he has grown as an actor. He has grown past his early Twilight days. And I don't think that he would have taken on this role if he didn't think he could handle it and bring something to the screen that is worthy of Batman and Bruce Wayne. So I'm really looking forward to this movie. Let me know what you guys think in those comments below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, everyone. So I really hope you guys enjoyed watching. Please come and say hi to me on Instagram and Twitter and all of my other social medias. I also want to give a huge shout out to my patrons, my Harlequins, Dark Knights, Red Hood Outlaws, and my Jokers, as well as my Rogue Gallery channel members. I appreciate your patronage and your memberships so much. If you're new to my channel, I hope you'll consider subscribing and let me know in those comments down below what kind of videos you'd like to see in the future. Okay, I'll see you guys next time. Bye, everyone.